Hey guys, what's up? Pasiboli here. This is now the last game or the last uh, prediction for this February 2, 2022 NBA game day. Uh, this is the battle between Portland Trail Blazers with a record of 21 and 30, uh, visiting Los Angeles Lakers in the uh, Crypto.com Arena uh, with a record of 24 and 27. This one will be played 10:30 p.m. Eastern Time, so that's going to be 11:30 a.m. here in Manila. All right. Uh, before we talk about these two teams, again, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Also, I would like to thank those who have uh, recently subscribed, and for those who have been following me um, ever since the channel has been, you know, has been created. Thank you, uh, thank you so much for the support. I hope you guys would, you know, would take care out there wherever you guys are. Um, okay, let's talk about this one now. Um, uh, let me pull up the Western Conference standings so that we can take a look at these two teams. Um, you know what? Uh, Los Angeles Lakers, they are at number 9 in the West. For their last 10 games, they have only won 3 times. And approaching this game, they are on a 3-game losing streak. I think this losing streak started when uh, LeBron James got injured. Portland Trail Blazers, they are right behind Los Angeles Lakers. They are at number 10. But uh, they, ha they have a better form. For their last 10 games, they have won 5. That's decent. Uh, but the same with Los Angeles Lakers, they've been losing lately. Approaching this game, Portland Trail Blazers suffered back-to-back -back losses. Los Angeles Lakers, they will be uh, enjoying the home court advantage on this. Um, in terms of form, man, I mean, in terms of momentum, uh, let's skip that one because both teams have been losing, as I said earlier. Um, in terms of fatigue, yeah, uh, we can also just uh, skip that one because both teams were able to rest last night or yesterday. So let's pull up the uh, let's pull up the injury list. All right, I'm looking at Port and Trail Blazers now, man. This is kind of long. Damon Lillard, Larry Nance Jr., Cody Zeller, Little um, are all out, confirmed. Now we got Anthony Simons, probable. Uh, Josef Nurkic, um, game time decision along with, Wat along with Watford. And CJ Ellaby is unquestionable status. All right, a lot of names down here. Although four are, just con four are confirmed. And then we got uh, one who is probable, that's Anthony Simons. And Nurkic and Watford, a uh, uh, game time decision. And then LAB, again, in a questionable status. All right, for Los Angeles Lakers, uh, this one's shorter. Kendrick Nunn and LeBron James are confirmed out. While Anthony Davis is probable, along with Malik Monk. The spread on this... Is minus 2.5 for Los Angeles Lakers. Okay, um, now this one's tough because, as you can see, um, the lineup of uh, Portland Trailblazers, uh, there are you know, there are like a couple who are in game time decision. There's like one who is improbable. You know, you, you just don't know. You just don't know who's going to appear. And that's, that's one of the challenges um, in terms of uh, placing bets ahead. Um, because again, we will never know. Sometimes we are, we are expecting that a player would actually be playing, but then he wouldn't, and then the other way around. Sometimes we're expecting that um, he won't be playing, but then he would. So uh, I'm not really sure about this Portland Trailblazers team right now because uh, their performance last time out against uh, who was that again? OKC. That was just crazy, man. That was crazily stupid, man. I love Portland Trailblazers, especially Damian Lillard, but I just don't know what happened to them on that, you know, on that game. Los Angeles Lakers, they have been struggling. Uh, three ga three uh, games, they have lost straight. Um, but we're sure that uh, Russell Westbrook would be there. Melo would be there, and as they as they said, uh, uh, Anthony Davis and uh, Monk would be probable for this game. So, um, and they are at home. Los Angeles Lakers is at the home, so I'm gonna I'm gonna pick Los Angeles Los Angeles Lakers on this. Um, I'm gonna pick uh, the one who's more comfortable uh, playing because again they are balling at their home, and again we are we are a bit sure that those players that I mentioned would be you know would be playing. Unlike for Portland Trailblazers, it's like the only one that I'm sure of 
who would be balling for them, who can really give a lot to them, would be McCollum and uh, Dennis Smith, perhaps. But yeah, I'm going to side with Los Angeles Lakers in here. I'm pretty sure Anthony Davis would want to get a win um, under his belt. Uh, without LeBron, you know what I'm saying. Uh, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure that you know he's wanting to get a win uh, with LeBron in the sidelines because he's wanting to prove that he can actually carry carry the team. All right. So my pick on this one would be Los Angeles Lakers minus two point five. Again, that's Lakers minus two point five. Peace out, pase love, and God bless.